Welcome to Chemiras Results Studio as we have just published our Q1 2024 results. My name is Mikko Pohela, Vice President for Investor Relations, and I'm here today with our new IR manager, Heidi Lehmoskumpu. Heidi, welcome to Chemira and to the team. Thank you very much, Mikko. It's a pleasure to be part of the team. And it surely has been an eventful past 10 days. Yes. Now, uh, let's go to Q1 results. There has been a lot of discussion on the decreased prices of pulp and bleaching chemicals. How did these prices affect Chemira? And how was the performance in Q1 overall? Well, overall, I'd say that we started the year strongly with our focused portfolio that is now fully focused on water treatment and pulp and paper. Our end markets in both segments, they continued to recover gradually. And, and we saw volume growth for ourselves both year on year and compared to the previous quarter of last year in both segments. The sales prices, as you say, for energy intensive pulp and bleaching chemicals, they did indeed decline uh, compared to the same period last year, so Q1 2023. And due to this, the organic growth was negative uh, during the first quarter. However, we do need to remember that a year ago, the sales prices for the energy intensive pulp and ble bleaching chemicals were at an elevated level. The political strikes that we saw in March and April in Finland, uh, they only had a limited impact on our Q1 performance uh, and profitability was overall very strong and the operative EBITDA margin was stable year on year at a record high level of 21.3% and we had strong margin performance in, in both segments. This was driven by successful cost management and also higher sales volumes. The beginning of the year was uh, very eventful. Uh, Kemira sold its uh, oil and gas business and also the new CEO started in, in uh, Q1. Uh, what are the priorities for Kemira going forward? Good question. And as, as we announced before, so Kemira closed the divestment of the oil and gas business on the 2nd of February. Uh, and the positive impacts of the divestment are clearly visible in the Q1 performance. So improved operative EBITDA margin, higher return on capital employed, and also the balance sheet is now stronger due to the proceeds uh, from the oil and gas divestment, and it is now at the record strong level. Then if we move to our new CEO, so Antti Salminen started as president and CEO in mid-February, and Antti has a solid track record uh, with Chemira since 2011, and he has led both segments very successfully. Uh, and Antti has spent his first months as CEO, meeting customers, employees, and taking a holistic look at the strategy. And I think it's fair to say that, that Kemira is now in excellent shape, both operationally and financially, and this provides an excellent foundation to build on. Uh, our strategic priorities, they are unchanged. So we continue to focus on, on water, renewable solutions, and also creating a digital services business. However, going forward, we will increasingly now focus on faster execution. And as a result, we are now reviewing our, our strategic initiatives and related targets to really see where we, where we can be quicker, more agile to create even better shareholder value going forward. Now let's go to this year. Uh, what is the outlook for 24? Our outlook for this year remains unchanged. Uh, we continue to expect uh, a sort of end market recovery in volume terms uh, during this year. And, and as we discussed, so we had an excellent start to the year and then we look at the remainder of, of 2024 with confidence. But we are still at early stages of the year and we see some uncertainties in the operating environment potential political strikes in Finland, and also the geopolitical tensions in the Middle East. And, and as a result, we have kept the outlook unchanged for both revenue and operative EBITDA. Thank you for the highlights, Mikko. Thank you, Heidi. If you have any IR-related questions, uh, please feel free to contact uh, both of us going forward. We also like to take this moment to invite you to our CMD which will be held on September 26th. The event will be held in Helsinki and can also be viewed online. Hoping to see you there.